today we are doing a really cool photo shoot um, to get us started, get used to the water, but also get some really cool shots for publicity for the show. So we are at this beautiful location. I don't know, you guys can't see it, but it's amazing. Um, and just taking shots all around outside. <laughs> the first show of our Theater Up Close series is uh, the Tony Award winning play Metamorphosis by Mary Zimmerman. This Metamorphosis is all about telling the Greek myths of Ovid uh, in a highly theatrical setting. And so what we're doing for our first show of our Theater Up Close series is we're actually building a 17 foot pool in the Carnival Studio Theater. And the play actually takes place on a stage around the pool and inside the pool. So today we're here at Adrian Arsh's house and we're in Adrian's pool and we're actually filming the commercial and the photo shoot that goes along with the play that kicks off our season. This play is really interesting to me because it's based on a series of classical myths, yet it's today. It's all about what goes on today. It's a very, very modern play, even though the all the myths are three, four thousand years old. And, you know, it still deals with all, everything that makes a play today, which is all the bad stuff. Murder, greed, uh, lechery, you know, it's everything that is bad makes a good play. When it was originally done, uh, what they did was use a pool of water as the centerpiece for their set and built a deck around the set. And since it's been done, ever since then, they've always used the water as part of the show. We're trying to bring in new, young, and highly engaged audiences to see theater and to look at theater as a different experience. So every time you come into the Carnival Studio Theater, there's a different setup, the seating configuration has changed, and we're always trying to push the boundaries of what theater is. And certainly having a play that takes place inside a swimming pool does that. But it's ultimately all about the stories. What Mary Zimmerman has done through writing the play is that each of these characters are trying to achieve something in their lives. And when they go into the water, they actually emerge and they've, they've undergone a change. They've actually experienced a metamorphosis. And so you see that character change as people are in and out of the water. I've done a lot of directing in the round uh, over, you know, over my career, so I'm used to that. I actually like directing in the round quite a bit. Directing in the water and underwater, um, we'll see what happens. We started today with this, uh, with this photo shoot, uh, which a lot of it has been underwater, and um, the, um, we'll see. We're, we're having a lot of time with the water, so we're moving into the pool very, very early, so hopefully it'll be just like directing dry and we just found out that one of our cast members can't swim. Uh, luckily, the pool is uh, the pool's pretty shallow. Yeah, 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 that's me. 75 laps every day. No, I cannot swim to save my life. I'm water, and I'm fine with water. I just legit cannot swim, nor float, nor open my eyes underwater. So if you just don't do those things, it's fine. Five. What we're going to do is we're going to follow our instructions from Justin for the setup of the snow shot. This is the third season of Theater Up Close, and we're really excited to be producing this show in partnership with the University of Miami because this gives the students who are studying to be theater professionals an opportunity to work as theater professionals at the same time as they're completing their studies. So we have a mix. Our company is a mix of professional actors who are living and working here in uh, South Florida, as well as the students who are now becoming professional actors with this production and really bring in extra depth to uh, what they're studying at UM. This is a cast of 14, 10 of them are UM students, four are professionals. And it's part of this collaboration with the Arsh Center is for students to work on a professional project uh, while they're still in school. They'll have audiences that are just gonna come in from all over Miami and South Florida. So it gives them a chance to get exposed to what their careers are going to be like. For someone like me, it's just fun to be able to come and do a show in Miami. It's something I've always wanted to do in this type of venue. We want to cultivate the next generation of actors and designers and technicians and keep them here in Miami as opposed to having them go off to seek employment in other places. So part of our mission at the Arts Center is to cultivate the next level of talent and to keep them living and working here in Miami. And the, the play is about life near the water. Um, you know, and then the water as a place where humans come from is a pretty solid metaphor. So it's, uh, it's actually great. I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, the set is gorgeous. I know there's going to be a lot of cool projections. The costumes, as you can see, that I'm wearing are really cool. Um, so I think it's going to look spectacular. 
because the show is being done in the round, every seat is a good seat. And uh, I would say that there's not a splash zone, but if you're sitting in the front row, you might want to lift your feet from time to time.